Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July the 25th of 2020, well, it is titled Tianwen 1 Mission to Mars. So what do we see here? Well, we see a rocket lifting up off through the atmosphere. You can see the jets of material that are spewing out down below it, which then propel the remainder of the rocket up out of the Earth's gravitational field. And it takes a significant amount of energy to be able to lift something off of the Earth. So when we look at a rocket, much of what we see is actually fuel and it takes a lot of fuel to lift even a small payload up into space. And in this case, we're actually sending a probe to Mars. This is being uh, launched from China and is going to explore Mars. It will have an orbiter and a lander and a rover to really be able to try to study Mars in a little more detail. Now, Mars has been one of the best studied planets for a long time, uh, mainly because it does show some similarities to Earth in that it has polar caps that come and go with the seasons. And it has a very thin atmosphere. And it also is known now for sure to have had liquid water on it at some point in the past. So it is really one of the best bets in our solar system if we're looking for a place where life may have formed at some point in the past. Now this is not the only mission heading towards Mars this month. We also have one launched by the United Arab Emirates and NASA is launching the Perseverance rover as well later this month on July 30th that is scheduled. So those three are going to explore Mars so we should have a much better uh, study of Mars over uh, the coming months. Now it'll take them a little while to get there. Mars is quite far away. And you might wonder why we're launching so many at once. And that is because we have to launch at specific times. You can't just launch at any time to another planet. You have to do it when it's going to have uh, use the least amount of energy. Otherwise, it requires even more energy and more time to try to send things there. So right now is the time to send things to Mars and what we call the launch window to keep it the energy down to a minimum is coming to a close soon and there'll be in the next one chance wouldn't be until 2022. So you would not want to delay this much longer or you would have to wait a couple more years to be able to get the craft there. So I am sure that the, we will be able to see some nice images once these do reach Mars and give us some more detailed studies of the red planet. So that was our picture of the day for July the 25th of 2020. It was titled Tianwen 1 Mission to Mars. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Hubble Ultra Deep. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.